Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we have some exciting updates for you regarding Social Security, SSI and SSDI. As many of you rely on these crucial benefits, it's important to stay informed about potential changes that could impact your financial future. In this video we'll discuss three big changes that might be happening soon, including a potential increase in benefits. So let's dive right in. Hello everyone. I'm and I'm here to break down the latest news and updates about Social Security, SSI and SSDI. If you find this information helpful, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more updates. Now, let's get started with the first big change. First up, we have some promising news regarding the Cost of Living Adjustment, or COLA. As you know, the COLA is an annual adjustment to Social Security benefits that helps keep up with inflation. In recent years we've seen relatively modest increases. However, experts are predicting a significant rise in the COLA for the upcoming year. This anticipated increase is largely due to higher inflation rates. As the cost of goods and services continues to rise, it's crucial for Social Security benefits to reflect these changes to help beneficiaries maintain their purchasing power. Some projections suggest we could see a COLA increase of up to 6%, which would be the highest in decades. Such an increase would mean more money in the pockets of Social Security recipients, helping them to better manage the rising costs of living. While we won't know the exact percentage until it's officially announced, this is definitely something to look forward to. Now, let's move on to the second potential change. The second big change we're monitoring is the potential expansion of benefits for those on Supplemental Security Income SSI and Social Security Disability Insurance SSDI. There's been a lot of discussion in Congress about improving these programs to better support beneficiaries. One proposed change is increasing the asset limits for SSI. Currently, SSI recipients are limited to $2,000 in assets for individuals and $3,000 for couples, which hasn't changed since 1989. Lawmakers are pushing to raise these limits to reflect current economic realities, allowing beneficiaries to save more without losing their benefits. This change would provide much-needed financial security to those on SSI, allowing them to build a small emergency fund or save for future needs. Additionally, there are discussions about simplifying the application process for SSDI and reducing wait times, which can be a major hurdle for those in need of immediate assistance. Last, but certainly not least, the third potential change is the enhancement of benefits for long-term Social Security recipients. There's a growing recognition that those who have been on Social Security for many years may need additional support, especially as they age. Proposals include introducing a longevity bonus for those who have been receiving benefits for a certain number of years. This bonus would help cover additional costs that often come with aging, such as healthcare and assisted living expenses. <laughs> 